This is like a giant coral mushroom. Oh, hello you guys. Welcome to Will Brown Art once again. Here with Little Otter, we're at Sunrise Lake Trail in Washington. And we are up in the parking lot right now, getting ready to go on this hike down to this lake behind us. And all around me is nothing but the most beautiful, glorious, powerful views and scenery. I definitely wanna come back here in the future, you guys, and do some painting videos of this place. It's amazing. Behind us over here, we have Rainier. I'll uh, show you a few shots in a minute here of, of this area, but we're gonna dive on this trail, head on down there, see what we can find. Highly suggest you come and check out this place, even if you wanna drive up here, even if you're not a hiker, and just spend some time just enjoying the sunrise or just the scenery in general. It's just beautiful. So thanks so much for joining me today, and uh, we're gonna get going. Guys, here's the information on the hike. As you can see, it uh, it is uh, pretty extensive. It goes all through here. We're right here, and this is kind of the viewpoint with the parking lot. And we're gonna come down around and try to go right over to this lake, the Sunrise Lake. But you can clearly see it. The trail goes all the way through here, Clover Lake, Dix Lake, um, all the way up uh, to this area, Brown Point or Peak. Yeah, Peak. And uh, the information here is the trailhead is round trip 7.2 miles, hiking time four hours, elevation 1200 feet. So moderate difficulty. Shouldn't be too bad if you wanna do all of that. But today, because of time, we're only gonna be able to try to get to that lake. So also it uh, says no pets allowed here, which we'd think that's a prom, but it's not because Otter's not my pet. He's my son, so let's go. <laughs> I love this, these old trees like this. Beautiful. I feel like I say beautiful a lot on my videos, you guys, but I can't help it because, I mean, I go to some of the most amazing places doing this YouTube channel. It is just absolutely extraordinary to see, you know, how, much, how beautiful nature really is. Like, look at that. As an artist, I just can't get enough of it but I'm really excited to get down and see this lake. So we're gonna keep going. Behold, Otter in his natural habitat. What's that? You hear that? What do you hear, Otter? Too much shadow on you, buddy. Wow, look at this, you guys. It just opens up here and there's this rock slide going all the way down. Opens, opens up into like a meadow or something down here. I don't know what kind of uh, brush and shrubbery that is. I think it's wildflowers and I'm hoping so because that would be pretty damn cool if that's all just wildflowers going through there. But we got to get lower in elevation to be able to determine that at this point. But man, that's beautiful. Look at that.
we made it to uh, the first divide or break in the trail. And uh, as you can see, we're very close to the Sunrise Lake at this point. All right, so as we come down close to the water, you can see how the trees um, just really kind of surround this lake, but there's still some grassy patches down towards the bottom here. Here, let's go down here, buddy. Good boy. And just a ton of these tiny little trees all the way along here. Absolutely beautiful. Really spectacular. So I'm gonna come down and get these shots. But you can see the wildflowers are all through here too. Coming through the bushes and the trees here, we pop out at the shore. Come on, Otter. Let's go. This way. Wow. Oh, look at the color of the water. I'm down at the lake, it's beautiful. I had to strip down, I'm gonna jump in. There's a thin coat of bugs across the top of the water, so I might get some protein while I'm out here, you know, just breathing them in. Other than that, everything looks beautiful. And if you look down into the water here, you can see there's a lot of sand with just a little bit of rocks, which makes it really nice for walking through this. Um, you know, I don't have to have water socks on or any, anything like that, and it doesn't hurt your feet, which is really nice about this lake. So I'm trying out the GoPro as well for the first time in the water. And so let's see what happens here. All right, let's see. I'm kind of nervous though to put the GoPro in the water. Ah, oh, that's nice though. All right, I'm gonna let go of you guys. Hopefully you don't sink. <laughs> All right, hopefully this is looking good. The GoPro's working good. I'm just gonna swim out here for a second. This is nice, because now I can take you out with me into my lakes and my adventures out in the wild. There's tons of bugs out here though. Holy crap. So nice. Oh my gosh. So healing, you guys.
My hair's getting long, you guys. It's all in my face. That is so nice, cool, refreshing. Oh, whoa, look at this guy. I'm going to explore this water and we're going to see what we can find in the deep. So I've been out here for a few hours. It is so beautiful, so refreshing. Swimming in this lake is so nice. Uh, little Otter's been running around. He's been hunting the little chipmunk things. He hasn't heard any of them. He's just so curious about everything. Was sniffing around around a frog as well. And uh, we're gonna walk around the lake though and see what we can find. Check out the mushrooms and maybe see if we can find some wild animals as well. So let's go guys and see what we can find. Let's go buddy. Oh, good boy. Otter, you guys running around. Otter, come here. Come say hi to the camera. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come on, bud. Come here. Come on. Good boy, Otter. Good boy. Look at this lake. Right up there is where we're parked. All this moss around here. Nice and soft, a little bit wet, but just really nice. Oh, so nice. Oh man, it's so refreshing. What do you think, buddy? You like it out here? Otter's having the best time, man. This is his favorite thing to do. It's just, he's trained to always stay within 30 feet of me or so, and I give him some freedom. There's no snakes out here. And so he can just kind of run around, he's safe. And then he stops when I say stop. He, uh, he comes right back to me when I call him and I'm just super proud of him. So he's able to really enjoy it. And he doesn't bite people, attack people, or really really even bark at people. And uh, he's just got a good heart. So it's a lot of fun. All I have to do is watch out for birds and really proud of the little guy. He's doing great. Let's keep going guys. Look what I found. This is like a giant coral mushroom, something along those lines, but look how big that is. It, it reminds me of a cauliflower mushroom, but it looks a little bit differently. I'm gonna grab this though, because that looks delicious, but I'm gonna make sure I identify the crap out of it because I'm not super familiar with these mushrooms, but my family members are. I got some uh, family members are really, really versed in this, so I'm gonna check in with them on this, but that thing is a monster compared to some of these little ones. 
guys, look at this, what I just found. It's like a big old butt coming off this tree. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. That's awesome. The tree goes all the way up. Looks like it's dead, but it's a big old burrow. Really cool stuff. All right, we're gonna start headed back up the trail now. See what we can find. So beautiful. just hiked back up to basically the top here and you can see the sun coming down through the valley here and tucking itself away behind those mountains as this thick cloud mist comes over the mountains and it is absolutely gorgeous such a beautiful place just to rest breathe take it all in I don't know if the camera's doing it justice but just extremely healing you don't even have to go on the hike. Just come here and have a picnic, man. It's worth it. All right, almost back to the car. You guys, oh my gosh. This is just transformed now. These clouds came in. The sun is a little bit hidden. It's not as bright. And you can just see all the snow on the mountains over there beautifully. It's all just lit up and so nice. Check out this bus that's going by, guys. Yeah. This guy's got the right idea. Looks like it could be burning some oil. Looks that way. Um, but uh, one day I hope to do a bus like that. Transform it, maybe a little bit larger though, longer. Okay. Well guys, I just wanna thank you so much for joining me on this adventure, Otter and I, I should say. Uh, it's been such a wonderful, amazing hike. I'm sitting up here and I'm just, I feel so full in my soul. Like all these beautiful views, I wanna paint it all. And so I highly suggest you guys come and check out this place. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. Also, a huge thanks goes out to my sponsor of this channel, Crystal Spirit. Thank you guys so much for sponsoring my channel. Um, if you're into rocks, crystals, minerals, and more, you will love checking out their website. Uh, there's a link in the description below. And if you tell them that Will Brown sent you, you get 10% off discount, which is really awesome. So huge thanks to my Patreons also. And check out the link to my children's book. I'm a traveling artist and I want to take you guys all over America painting the most beautiful areas and showing you guys all the most coolest areas as I built a tiny home, an art van, and lots of videos to come. So thanks so much for joining me today. Once again, check out this hike. It's worth it. And I'll see you next time. Bye.